up, Facebookers and Facebookettes? I'm Tanner Accord, and this is Facebook News Television. Social networking sites took off with MySpace. Now, the MySpace killer ended up being Facebook. But is there a Facebook killer in the shadows? Google has created a social networking site called Google Me. Google already has a significant amount of social properties, including Picasa, YouTube, Blogger, Google Attitude, and Google Profiles, which can all be rolled into one simple platform. They also have an, a mobile operating device called Android for your phone, which they will integrate straight into the hardware. With all this, they can create one central location with all your Google searches, your Twitter updates, chatting with all your buddies online, your Google Gmail, and uploading videos to one simple website. Who better to take on Facebook than Google themselves? On Friday, Facebook started testing out a new facial detection technology. If anyone has ever tried uploading photos or a large album to Facebook, you know that tagging all your friends and even yourself is just a long and annoying process. Well, that's about to all go away with the new facial detection technology, which is going to run through all of your photos automatically, and you're going to answer one simple question, whose face is this? Now, the technology is the same that you see in digital cameras today. Although it's not new, it is a very clever and welcomed addition to the Facebook photo set and it's only one of the many improvements to come to Facebook Photos. The race between President Obama and Lady Gaga is over. Lady Gaga's online entourage numbers surpassed President Obama on June 25th. She posted a black and white video on her Facebook page saying thank you all for the love and support and for sticking by me for all the fame and the fame monster. I'm guessing she's referring to the fame monster as all those crazy ass outfits she wears on a daily basis. Friday Night Lights actor Zach Guilford is filling the Facebook love. So far, about 8,600 fans on his Facebook fan page are trying to get him nominated for a Primetime Emmy Award. Guilford plays Matt Saracen in a high school drama debuted in 2006. His fans are impressed with his acting ability when Saracen's father is killed in the military in Iraq. Now, Guilford left the current fourth season, but will be returning for the fifth and final season. He says it makes sense because he still plays a pivotal role in the lives of a lot of the characters still around. We'll see if Guilford can be the next Betty White who used her Facebook fan page to get a spot on Saturday Night Live. Don't forget to press the like button on the Facebook News Television fan page located at FB News TV. And check us out on iTunes. It's July 4th weekend, so put on your American flags, grab a cold one, and let's get smashed. It's the American way. I'm Tanner Cord, and this is Facebook News Television, according to me.